Hello everybody and welcome back to Vinyl Talk with Tavis And I'm Tavis It's the Soul Train You all, did you all see the Soul Train Awards last night? Did you all see that? <laughs> Lord, this is the only time I can talk about it Is while I'm driving going to work this morning I tell you what, that was a great show. It had its crazy moments, but all in all, it was a good show. But I'm here to really talk about um, Jimmy Jam and Terry Lewis. I don't know what's going on here. Jimmy Jam and Terry Lewis, that tribute was phenomenal. I loved every second of it. I hadn't seen Mary Davis in years singing live. Maybe I'm just behind and, and don't know and didn't know that she was still performing. Her voice, it just brought back everything. There's a guy, he has a YouTube channel. His name is Mike T. Mike, you said it all when you said this. You had to be there. In that time and space, of music in the late 70s, early 80s, mid 80s, late 80s, 90s. It just seems like the music was magical. And in the R&B spectrum of things, Jimmy Jam and Terry Lewis were a phenomenal couple of guys who had their music writing pen on the heart of African Americans. They knew exactly what we needed to dance, or just anybody. But for me, I'm thinking African Americans. The music that they wrote, they produced, is just magical and mystical, like the sun shining on my face this morning. Forgive me, please forgive me. Um, when I saw Mary Davis come out, I jumped up out of my chair like a bunny rabbit coming out of a hole. I was like, whoa, Jesus, look at Mary Davis. <laughs> Woo, Lord. Mm. And when I saw Sherelle, okay, now let me, let, me, let me tell you something, okay? Sherelle, she looked good. Okay, that long hair and that tight, bodysuit, but Alexander, what, what's going on, what's going on, what's going on, Alexander? Child, I know we all getting old, okay? God help us, but I tell you what, no excuses. He could have had a better type suit. What's, what, what's up with these loose fitting suits these days? Is that the style these days? All the guys are wearing loose fitting suits. They look like vagabonds. I could be wrong. I'm not the most stylish guy. Well, wait a minute. I am in some regard. But I'm sure that Alexander O'Neill's vocals were dubbed in. I think that his original vocals to Saturday Love, because when he started saying Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, I was like, who is that singing? That don't sound right. It sounded ridiculous, but I still liked it. I felt, I felt joy. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. I was like, who is that singing with Sherelle? <laughs> and then when Alexander's part came in, when I look at you, memories of love, I heard Alexander's original vocals because when he would come in and sing with it, it didn't sound right. So he was trying to sing over his overdubs. I heard it. I have a very good ear. Like he needs to just let the vocals play and just lip sync because he don't sound too right. That's all right though. Praise the Lord, hallelujah about it. I'm, st I'm still happy. And when Morris Day came out, y'all, okay, that was the creme de la creme. That was a great performance. Morris Day and those synths, the synthesizers, Morris Day killed it. He did a great job. I'm so proud of him. Y'all, that music is absolutely classic. I'm so glad. I'm about to get teary-eyed. 
I'm about to overflow in my eyes. I am so glad that I found that album from the time at that thrift store for only 99 cents. I played it all last night and I played it this morning. Jungle Love. Oh, Jesus, that's some good music. That is some awesome music. Janet Jackson, she wasn't there last night, but they just honored her all throughout the night by playing her music. They started out the show with her songs. Lord, that was a great show. But I'm going back to my wonderful accolades. Jimmy Jam and Terry Lewis has written, have written the most beautiful R&B music ever written in the 80s, late, late 70s, 80s, 90s. They work with Human League. I'm only human, born to make mistakes. I am just a man. That's a jam. I need to get that on vinyl. I need to get that on vinyl immediately. Human League, I'm only human. Jimmy Jam and Terry Lewis produced that song. Did they write it? I'm not sure. Great tribute. I am in awe. One more rant. I don't know what was going on with Ad Nesby with the sounds of blackness. You know what? <laughs> Leave it to us. Leave it to us to oversang other folks. Ad Nesby oversang, oversang all them soloists. Optimistic, singing optimistic. over singing everybody just sing your part and go back into the shadows and come forward when it's time for you to sing see that's why groups break up that's why groups break up because people like to over sing other people they want to be in the limelight we know we know Anne, that you are the soloist leader we know that but you need to give other people time to shine that those poor little girls singing at the beginning when the midst of sorrow. That's a low sounding part. And then Ann Nesby. Ah, yeah. When the love can love be done. Ah, yeah. That was unnecessary. I, I'm, I'm telling you the truth. Unnecessary. But, honey, I got my Sounds of Blackness album and I was listening to it this morning again. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> These folks. You know what? I say that a lot. You know what? That was a great show. I'm glad that I watched it and I watched the YouTube clips. Watch the YouTube clips. You'll see what I'm talking about. Again, I'm so proud of Jimmy Jam and Terry Lewis. A, an award long overdue. It should have been given years ago. But you know what? Everything has its time and season and purpose. And God is good all the time, and they deserve it. And I'm glad they are getting this award, the Legends Award, a Living Legends Award. And I cannot wait to see what else Jimmy Jam and Terry Lewis has up their sleeve musically. I can't wait. He says, Jimmy Jam said that 2020 is going to show, he's going to show out. I can't wait. Well, everybody, other than Jimmy Jam's big suit, and Nesby's soaring vocals over everybody else. <laughs> the show was really good, but I just wanted to talk about that tribute. Jimmy Jam and Cherry Lewis, I love you too. Wow. Well, music can sure take you places. Like I say all the time, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, vital community, friends and loved ones, with music. Mm, mm, mm. With music, be inspired and stay inspired.